Good morning, guys. Hello, how are you? This is Binay Hasawi once again here in Saudi Arabia. Today is Thursday. Napagandang uh, panahon at hindi makulimlim. Medyo malamig ng kaunti. At hindi rin gano'ng mainit. Oh yeah. So now I'm going uh, to my work. Napagaganda ang panahon. And uh, I hope na nasa mabuti kayong kalagayan. And uh, I hope na patuloy tayong mag-iingat sa panahon na ito. And ito na ang panahon na we have to uh, take good care of our health. Dahil uh, mahirap magkasakit. Ika nga. Mahal magpagamot at mahal ang mga bilihin. So thanks the Lord na patuloy tayong iniingatan sa araw-araw and I hope and I pray to the Lord na patuloy kayong uh, iingatan ng Panginoon and of course be good to others as well at patuloy tayong gumawa ng mabuti sa ating kapwa lalo na sa mga nangangailangan Thanks my friend and uh, I will try to upload a new video because until now I'm still searching for the good content of my YT channel so if you have some comments suggestions Just drop your comments and message or you can direct PM to my uh, uh, messenger so I could uh, try to uh, do something what is a good content for this YT channel. Thank you my friends. And I hope that uh, you're good every day. Thank you. And today is March 4. So napakabilis ng uh, takbo ng panahon. And uh, Currently here in Saudi Arabia, still uh, uh, merong uh, protocol na bawal ang uh, uh, gathering, physical gathering. And I hope na bumaba na rin ang uh, cases ng uh, coronavirus. Dahil uh, ito ang dahilan kung bakit uh, until now always uh, they are extended for uh, this uh, curfew and uh, for this protocol na pinagbabawal ang uh, physical gathering Even the restaurants and coffee shops, they're prohibited to have this uh, physical gathering. So uh, it's so hard for those 
small establishment here to survive dahil uh, ang kanilang uh, services like uh, restaurants, coffee shops ay wala silang dine-in puro take-out sila or puro take-away ang kanilang uh, service to the clients and customers so uh, please include in your personal uh, devotion and prayer na nawa ay uh, ma tapos na matatapos na itong uh, pandemic na ito and please cooperate do not ignore I don't know when it comes to health patuloy nating ingatan ng ating uh, kalusugan kumain ng maayos mag-exercise and of course if you have time na mag-search on Google a lot of things na makakatulong informations materials suggestions na makikita natin sa Google about uh, about health dahil napakahalaga sa ating buhay may pangangalagaan natin ang ating health dahil kapag uh, nagkasakit tayo of course affected lahat hindi lamang yung ating uh, mga mal sa buhay pati yung ating uh, financial so uh, napakahirap pag nagkasakit especially this time of pandemic hope you uh, take care of your health and of course don't forget to pray don't forget to pray napakahalaga na tayo ay uh, patuloy na uh, kakaroon ng connection sa ating uh, Panginoong Diyos dahil uh, apart from Him We can do nothing sa ating mga ginagawa. Wala tayong uh, magagawang uh, mabuti at wala tayong magagawa sa ating uh, katawan kung tayo lamang ay uh, aasa sa ating sariling kakayanan at aasa sa ating sariling talino because I have uh, a lot of friend a lot of uh, mga kakilala they have uh, money they have uh, cars and uh, they have also uh, what I mean is financially stable So, uh, they can buy anything they want. But the problem is, without guidance of the Holy Spirit, wala silang guidance. At the end, they lost everything. Pati yung kanilang uh, relationship with the, the family, nasira because of the, of this uh, you know without uh, guidance of the holy spirit without the guidance of the holy spirit from the god from god walang mangyayari sa ating buhay so once again guys friends so please take care of yourself don't forget to pray ask the lord for guidance every day do not lend on your own understanding, but stay focused on the Lord, according to Proverbs. It says, trust in the Lord with all your heart, and do not lend on your own understanding. So, we encourage tayo na tayo patuloy na uh, magtitiwala sa Panginoon 
at patuloy tayong uh, mananalig sa kanya and do everything as much as possible na ito ay mabuti sa paninin ng Diyos at sa ating kapwa. So for this time, lalo na sa sitwasyon natin ngayon, we really don't know what lies ahead, what lies ahead in our lives. Maraming pwedeng mangyari, maraming uh, maaring uh, magaganap. But one thing I can say is To trust in the Lord is the ultimate and the perfect one for us to do. Sa lahat na ating gagawin ay dapat tayong manalig sa Panginoon. Not because we have money. Not because we don't have money. Not because we are unhealthy. Or not even because we are healthy. So whatever uh, we have, whatever situation we have, napakahalaga that we have to trust the Lord. We have to trust the Lord. So once again, thank you. Thank you. And I hope... Uh, You subscribe to my YouTube channel. Sa hindi pa nakapagsubscribe and hit the bell button and select all. And please give me your comments and suggestions because until now I am still searching for a good content of this YouTube channel. Thank you and this channel. Actually, um, I uh, I pray to the Lord that uh, it may be uh, uh, useful for uh, glorifying the Lord, and uh, it may be useful to uh, uh, glorifying God. In our lives, because a lot of YouTube channels nowadays, talagang napakalihis, and so we can so we can see a lot of YouTube channels nowadays obviously they are only focusing on how to earn money. So it is, it is a must. It is, it is, it is very important for us, especially sa atin mga born again Christians or Bible believers Christians, that we should have to consider that nowadays. A lot of young adults now they are misleading already. So hope this channel, or hope the Christian channels, YouTube channels, are imay magagamit ito to help and guide people, especially the new generation and the young adults. Thank you, guys. Thank you, friends. Thank you for watching this video and I hope that you will enjoy it. God bless you all. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.